guys it's jasmine so i just finished recording this makeup look for you guys i'm sorry i've been like missing lately i haven't been uploading as much as i have been for like the last couple months so sorry but i'm trying to get back in the groove of things um i've just had a lot a lot a lot going on and you guys know well if you follow me on instagram you know that i took my cosmetology state boards and i did pass so i'll be making a video about that pretty soon and yeah, so I just wanted to create this makeup look for you guys. I absolutely love it. I think it's pretty simple and straight to the point. Um, a great way to glam up an eye look is just to use two, like one color on like each side of your lid, if you know what I mean, like on the outer and inner corner, and then place a pop of like shimmer in the center, and it's just beautiful. I love it, love it, love it. And you can have like a little blending shade things like that which I think is pretty simple and always looks great so I decided to do like a berry fall look I guess so yeah guys that's the look that I would try to go for I hope you guys enjoy it and if you want to see how I got this look then just stay tuned for the video bye so I'm gonna start off with the Too Faced shadow insurance and I'm gonna use that to prime my eyes or eye now I'm gonna take the color caramel from the Amrezy palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills and use that as my transition color. This is like one of my favorite, favorite transition colors. Like I would get the palette just for caramel and Morocco, honestly. Now for my Morph, Morphe brushes um, palette, I'm gonna take this berryish color and apply that to the outer and inner corner of my eyelids and then connect it in the center but leaving the middle of my eyelid free of color. And I love this color guys, it's so pretty. And then you just want to deepen those colors, well this color as much as you would like, to your liking I guess you can say. And just make sure you blend, blend, blend. Now I'm going to take this shimmery purple color from the same palette from Morphe Brushes. And I'm going to use my finger to apply that in the center of my eye and blend it out. You want to make sure you blend it so you don't have any harsh lines. And then I'm just going to go in with the blending brush and blend some more. And now from the same palette, I'm going to take this taupish or creamy color and use that as my brow bone highlight. Next, I'm going to take the same shimmery color that I use on the center of my eyelid to apply to my inner tear duct. And now I'm going to tight line my eyes with the Rimmel Exaggerate Eye Cool. And then I'm going to use the Lorac Pro Front of the Line um, Liquid Eyeliner to do my typical wing liner. I feel like this time I made it a little bit longer than I usually do. For mascara, I'm going to use this Tarte. I think it's called Gifted Mascara. It came in a little gift set that I got, but I think this is, this is their Amazonian clay line or something. I'm not sure. And then offline, I applied these House of Lashes Iconic Lashes, which are now my new favorite. So now I'm going to move to my bottom lash line. I'm going to apply that same berry color that I used just to smoke it out a little bit. And then I'm going to add a black color right on my lash line to deepen it. And now I'm going to move on to my face. I already applied foundation off camera and I'm going to use this Black Up Cosmetics Radiance Concealer in 02 and apply that under my eyes. And I'm just going to blend that with my finger and also sharpen the edge of my eyeshadow. And then I'm just taking a brush to blend it out a little bit better. And to set that, I'm going to be using my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Dark. Mm -hmm. 
to bring the warmth back into my face, I'm going to use the CoverGirl Queen Collection Bronzer in Ebony Bronze. And I'm applying that to the hollows of my cheek, my jawline, and also on my forehead or temples. For blush, I'm going to be using one of my favorite, favorite blushes, which is the Milani Bake Blush in Red Vino. The struggle <laughs> trying to open that. And I'm just applying that to the apples on my cheeks and blending back. And then I'm going to go in and add some mascara to my bottom lashes. And this is the same one, the Tarte Gifted Mascara. Then I move into the lips. I'm going to use the NYX Brown Lip Liner to line my lips. If you see my eyes keep looking over to the side, I'm watching Netflix, I'm watching Once Upon a Time. I freaking love that show. I didn't think I would like it, but I love it. So for lipstick, I'm going to be using Max Velvet Teddy, and I'm going to apply that to my lips. And then I'm just going to go back in with the brown lip liner just to fix it up a little bit more and blend the two colors together. And guys, that's the completed makeup look. I hope you guys enjoy. I think this is the perfect look for fall or a night out. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Bye!